Great day for baseball in Cleveland on Father's Day as the Indians look to make it two out of three against the Nationals. Corey Kluber getting the start for the Tribe. In the fourth inning, he's in a two-on, nobody-out jam, but will strike out Adam LaRose for out number one. Then Jason Wirth goes down swinging, and after that, Ian Desmond goes down the same way. Kluber K's the side and escapes the jam. Steven Strasburg starting for Washington, his first appearance since May 31st. He was on the DL with a straight lat muscle. Bottom four, Carlos Santana singles up the middle. That brings home Jason Kittness. It's 1-0 Tribe, the only run Strasburg would allow in five innings of work. Top six now. Again, the Nats have two on and nobody out, but Ryan Zimmerman strikes out for out number one. And then LaRose grounds out to the right side. Jason Kittness starts the slick 4-6-3 double play. And once again, Cleveland escapes the jam unharmed. Top seven now, the Nationals have them loaded with nobody out, but watch this magic trick from Kluber. First, Jonathan Solano lines one to the right side, but Mark Reynolds starts the unassisted double play. And the next batter up for Washington is Roger Bernadina. Swung on a chopper to short, charged by Avila's clubs, throws, he got him! And Kluber with a standing ovation. Bases loaded, nobody out, and keeps the Nationals off the board again. WTAM provides the call. Kluber tosses eight scoreless frames and strikes out eight. Bottom eight now. Man on third for Kipnis. He'll drive one deep to right off Craig Stammen. Jason Worth makes the catch, but in comes Michael Bourne on the sack fly. Cleveland leads it two to nothing. Top nine now. Vinny Pistano on to close. The Nationals have one on and two out for Steve Lombardozzi. The next delivery, Worth takes off. A swing and a ground ball up the middle. Behind second, Avila shortstop, clubs, throws, ball game! And Vinny Pastano gets his first save, and Corey Kluber with another brilliant effort. WTAM provides the call once again, so Corey Kluber picks up his first ever home win. He's now 1-6 lifetime at Progressive Field. The Indians record their ninth shutout as a team this year, and Jason Kipnis ups his hit streak to 10 games.